In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to upload files to PebblePad. There are actually many ways of uploading files to PebblePad. I'll discuss the three most popular ways here. The first is, from your PebblePad homepage, you will see this Upload New panel. This opens the Upload tool as a new page. The Upload tool provides you with two easy ways to select files for upload. You can browse for files in your file manager, for example Windows, File Explorer or Finder in Mac and simply drag and drop the files on the drag a file here area. This option is not available on touch devices. Alternatively, clicking on or choose a file will open up a file manager window for you to browse and select the files you would like to upload. With either option you can select a single file or select and upload multiple files at once. Once you have selected the correct file for upload, you can then change the name of the file, add a description for the file, or add a tag to your file, and then click on Confirm Upload. The second method is to click on the Burger menu and choose the option to upload a file. This opens the Upload File tool in a small pop-up window that overlays the page you are on, so you don't have to stop what you are doing and can go to another page just to upload a file. For example, if you're completing a large workbook and realize you need to upload evidence for a particular question, uploading from the burger menu means you can stay on task. From here, the process of uploading is the same as the first method. The third method is when you are adding an image to a portfolio. So I'm opening up a portfolio here and I'm going to open up one of the pages. If I click on Add Content and choose to add an image and open my Assets Store, you'll see when this sidebar opens, one of the options here is to Upload. When clicked, this will display the Upload tool within the sidebar. If you upload just one image, that image will be automatically selected for you. If you upload multiple images, they will be displayed in the sidebar image gallery and you can select the one you want from there. 